Welcome back to the studio. Thank you guys for joining me. I'm Shauna and I'm joined here with Sauce on the Blue. I'm so excited. Yay, Tim. Well, good morning. Yeah, good morning. Thank you so much. And I'm so excited to talk about what you guys have in store with your restaurant. And this is happening tonight, correct? Yes, we have our um, Robert Mondavi wine pairing dinner this evening. Okay, and Robert Mondavi we know is a famous wine. So how does that work? You have different courses, you have different wines. Like if, if someone's like, I want to sign up, what do they do? Well, we have a seven course pairing. Okay. So it's going to be seven different wines. We're opening a Fumé Blanc first, then heading to the Reserve Pinot Noir, their Maestro, which is their 50th anniversary. Robert Mondavi turned 50 last year, or the winery turned 50. And then we have three different set, um, Cabernet Sauvignons. We have a, a 97, uh, yeah, excuse me. We have a 2014. We have a 76 and a 96 cabs that will be opening tonight. Wow, a 76 cab. A 76 cab. I'm excited about this. We haven't even tried it yet. I'm dying to see what it tastes tonight. Yeah. So, and I mean, that's a, a lot of people don't have that opportunity to taste, you know, wines that have had that opportunity to, you know, effectively age, right? Exactly. Because, I mean, and what makes a, a good wine, really? I mean. Well, if you think about it, this was Mondavi's, um, the wine that will be open tonight was his 10th anniversary wine. So this was only the 10th wine that they had made as a family. Wow. So we're kind of excited to be opening that tonight. And. You know, this was recorked, I guess, in the late 90s, you know, because the, the wine is going to be older than the corks can actually survive, so. Wow, that's really You know, we've got a representative from the winery coming out this evening, too, to give the lecture and the talk. It's not really a lecture. It's more of a, of a pairing with dinner and food. Yeah, it's more entertaining, because I think that what makes it so special is the story behind the, the meal itself and gathering. So uh, you guys are almost sold out, is that correct? Do you have we've a got couple a couple of seats spots? left. Okay. Yep. People can call the restaurant and make a reservation for tonight. We can probably take five, maybe ten more if I um, move a couple of things around, but we have about ten left. Mm -hmm. Tell us a, a, a little bit about your restaurant. You guys are relatively new. Um, just tell us about the atmosphere. You walk in there, I, I just, it's so classy in there, but I want your, your opinion. <laughs> I love well, it. Well, we have been open now six months and two weeks, something like that. Wow. So we are a family-friendly, polished, casual diner. We're kind of... Um, We'll have people there in dresses on first dates, as well as people sitting there in ski clothes after, after a day of skiing. <laughs> and that, that's what makes it so special. You guys are also located right on the Blue River, is that correct? Yeah, we're right outside the Blue River, right next to, to um, the Silverthorne Pavilion. And, you know, it's about, what, a quarter of a mile north of I-70, right in Silverthorne. Yeah. And cool. the new heart of Silverthorne. We're hoping that this is going to be the, um, the center of Silverthorne as things get going. And we've got the, you know, the theater opening here in two months, so we're excited about that. That is really cool. Uh, so also tell us a little bit. These are the, the, the dinner that's happening tonight. So you guys also have some live music, is that correct? So we have John Triselli play or Leon Littlebird play every Sunday. So we do music every Sunday around 3.30. We're doing it for, um, for the locals and for the people that are here on vacation as well. It's kind of, um, you know, everybody does music on Friday and Saturday nights. We're trying to do something a little bit different, give us something to do on a Sunday night. Mm -hmm. um, this week we have John and John's playing and Jess, you know Jess. Yeah. Jess is actually going to be playing at our wine dinner for us this week, too. Oh, how wonderful. So for the wine dinner tonight, we actually have two violinists and a stand-up bass playing. So it's going to be kind of, um, it's a little bit special event for us this evening. It's one that I'm really excited about, of course. Yeah, and this is really unique. So this is a very special event, but you always do these wine tasting, uh, wine dinners quite often. How often? And how do people find out and sign up for those as well? We do it the first Tuesday of each month. Um, it's always listed on our website, which is Sauce on the Blue, you know, Dot com. So we, you'll, you'll get that information. You can also stop by the restaurant and get put on our mailing list or our email list as it is nowadays. And, you know, it's always the first Tuesday. We won't be doing one in May just because it's going to be shoulder season a little bit. But we will do one more next month in April. We haven't decided on the, on the vineyard yet, but we'll have that information here probably by the end of the day today. Wonderful, Tim. So uh, tell us, uh, how do people find out and sign up for this particular dinner? This is happening tonight. They're opening a 1976 Robert Madavi, okay? <laughs> Just let you know. So you get her call. How do they find out? How do people get uh, on, on this dinner list? Well, they can call the restaurant at 970-468-7488, at and then they can make reservations for it at the restaurant. Please, if I'm not there this morning, just leave your name and number, and I'll contact you as soon as I get back. Yeah, great. And uh, you can also check out sauceontheblue.com. Is that correct? Yes. Perfect. And, and I'll be at the restaurant probably in about two hours. You know, it snowed last night. we got to get a couple <laughs> runs in this morning. <laughs> yeah. It's just stay warm out there. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Thank you so much. It's always a pleasure. Well, great and, to see uh, you. We will, uh, well, I hope you guys are uh, going to be over at Sauce and Blue tonight. It's going to be a lot of fun. And we'll be back after this.